Hello people, how is it going? My name is Mariusz and in this video we're gonna talk about essential accessories for filmmakers and photographers. The things I'm gonna talk about are basically my essential things that I always use when I film or take photographs. So I'm gonna talk about them because I think it might be useful for you to use some of them as well. The first thing I'm gonna talk about is the ND filter from Tiffin. And I got the one from Tiffin and what the ND filter does, it's basically like a sunglasses for your camera, but you can change the amount of how much light you wanna get in the camera and yeah you can just see that over here you make it even darker or less dark and this is really useful for achieving the cinematic look when it comes to filming so you have the right shutter speed to write frame rate and also really really useful for when you want to do a long exposure photography yeah you just pop it on your lens and you can adjust on how dark you want your frame to be and you're able to achieve very long uh, shutter speeds for long exposure photography and also if it's super bright you can shoot at very open apertures and not crazy amount of shutter speed so definitely recommend to have variable ND in your kit and just carry with you and and you're gonna definitely use it I've been using it all the time. The second thing that I have is this amazing camera strap from Peak Design and I really wished I bought one much earlier because when I bought it I actually started taking more photos because I've been always just like lazy to take my camera with me when it's now I can just easily pop this strap on it and remove it when I want so like when I want to put my camera on a tripod I can just remove the strap really quickly because of this anchor links and if I want to put it on I'm just putting this on really quickly and it works super convenient super easy to set up and remove from your camera the next thing is this really really awesome uh, Siri tripod Siri table tripod and I use that all the time when I'm vlogging when I'm filming as a second thing to uh, hold my camera so it's more steady and as a selfie stick when I'm vlogging and also for time lapses and long exposures just set it up and you're able to film the time lapse or shoot the long exposure photography really easily really compact much more compact than gorilla pod so yeah this is my choice for that and i actually made a video about it so if you want to check it out i'm gonna link it over here so go and check this one out and yeah check out this little tripod because it's so good the next thing is headphones i always have headphones with me i use those mainly for editing the vlogs and editing the films and when i'm using them at my computer but they are also super super good when it comes to traveling when it comes to being on a plane on a train or in a car because they have noise cancelling so you just pop them on your ears and you cannot hear anything you cannot hear screaming babies in the planes and you cannot hear people arguing or complaining as well so that's really useful because you don't want to be listening to that um, but when I'm not using those for editing or for listening to music I have my airpods with me all the time as well and those are just super convenient I just use them all the time when I listen to music and what that gives me basically like I pop them into my ears play some nice music and go for a photo walk and that puts me in a really good mood and like makes me want to do photography in a certain way so yeah I would definitely recommend those they are a little bit expensive but yeah I've been actually very surprised on how good those are and how convenient they are like I wasn't about to buy them at first but then I started seeing more and more people with them and seen a little bit of YouTube videos about them and I decided to get them and and I'm actually really happy I did because since I got them I use them all the time and I don't really even think about if I should have uh, headphones with me or I shouldn't have them because I just have them in my backpack or in my pocket and if I want to 
watch a YouTube video in a train or when I want to listen to music when I'm doing photography they are always there and I use them all the time the next thing you need a power bank I'm using this one I'm gonna link in below and I'm gonna link all those things below as well um, I'm using this one because some company just sent it to me uh, but I would recommend some anchor stuff which I'm gonna be linking down below as well uh, you're gonna need that because you're gonna be able to charge your camera batteries you're gonna be able to charge your camera your phone and with that to charge your phone I would recommend this amazing iPhone cable from anchor once again really nice braided cable it's not gonna fall apart like Apple cables really easy to just have that in your back and not worry that you're gonna break it because it's quite uh, durable and yeah it's just it looks really good as well it's the same color as my computer so that's really nice for me and about charging the batteries I'm also always recommending this one to people that have the a7 series cameras uh, basically USB charger for two of the batteries that comes with two extra batteries and I have like two or three of those and I recommend it to everybody like because it's so convenient you just basically take USB cable plug it into it and you can charge it from the power bank which is super useful and yeah it's so good because you just basically plug it into any USB brick and you're able to charge it so yeah definitely get this one definitely get this one I, I I'm really happy that I found this and yeah with Sony a7R2 you need so many batteries and I even sometimes run out of the batteries so I've been able to charge it from power bank and that was super useful for me and super convenient and the last thing that I have is this thing that is again super convenient that I'm so happy that I found it it's a keychain for your keys and it has all the tools that you need for photography or videography uh, it has the coin tool so you don't need to carry the coin to change the tripod plates uh, on your camera it has an allen key and it has a carabiner so you can basically just uh, attach it to something to your backpack or to something like that and for people who drink beers uh, or coke i don't know it has a bottle opener as well so that's really useful to be able to crack open a beer after work i don't drink but if you do that would be useful for you um, and it's actually a really nice keychain as well uh, yeah I think it's nice and I'm super happy that I found it I also carry the microphone all the time the microphone that I'm using right now the Rode Video Micro now it's in a frame Rode Video Micro is the best microphone for vlogging in my opinion and if you want a cheap really good microphone you can actually hear it now because I'm recording that with it uh, just get this mic I used to use the Sennheiser MKE 400 but I've, I've been running out of the batteries and there was a couple of situations where I forgot to switch it on as well and this one you just plug it into your camera you don't need a battery it just works and it's super convenient this is all the essential accessories I have with me when I'm carrying my back if you want to check out any of those the links to Amazon will be in the description this is affiliate links so if you buy anything from that uh, you supporting this channel by giving me a little bit of commission on the Amazon purchases you're making and you're not paying anything extra so thank you very much for that and if you want to check out the music that you're listening to right now I use Soundstripe and again I made a video about it so check it out here and subscribe to Soundstripe because they have amazing music for your videos and this is it so keep it sleek guys peace and love and I'll see you in the next one bye